Okay, so you've seen the team uh, for our round 12 Gallagher Premiership game against Exeter Chiefs here at the Stoop uh, tomorrow. Uh, two or three things just going to bring your attention to. The first, of course, is the remarkable achievement of Mark Lambert to make his 250th appearance uh, for the famous quarters. The plan always was for Mark to start this game, uh, obviously with the injury to, to Santiago uh, last week. Uh, who will be out for about two, three weeks, uh, made the choice even easier for us as a squad, as a coaching group, uh, and as a great cause for celebration. We want the team to perform well for, for us and, of course, for, for Lamy as well. Uh, alongside him, Scott Baldwin made 26 tackles last week, uh, gave the kind of performance that we knew we'd get from a 34-capped uh, international hooker. Uh, and alongside him, Simon Carrot completes the front row, who, again, had a really fine game last week. Uh, in the second row, in the engine room, we see the return of Matt Simmons, uh, which is a great boost for the team. And uh, in the backs, we see the return of Ross Chisholm as well, uh, replacing the injured Caden Murley. Um, I suppose the most notable inclusion this week would be Francis Saeli, um, who makes his long way to return from a frustrating season, uh, again, with injury, unfortunately. Uh, but we're looking forward to seeing the impact that Francis can make, not only tomorrow, uh, but for the rest of the season. Uh, on to tomorrow's, tomorrow's game. Um, unfortunately, again, we see that the clouds are greying, uh, the rain is coming and the wind, wind is coming as well. And it's important that we learn from some really valuable lessons we've had in the wet this season against Worcester, uh, against Bristol earlier on the season, against Bath last week, against Ulster at home, you know. And we've got to be able to manage the field better in the middle third. It's something we've been working hard at this week. Uh, we train with wet balls, we train with soapy balls, uh, we train into the wind, we train with the wind. Uh, we try different elements of our game that we think will be most crucial uh, when the weather turns as it is going to tomorrow. So we need your support. We need to come down and, and cheer the boys through through those tough moments. We're playing a very, very strong team in Exeter. We've had two or three really tough encounters against them over the last 15 months and we want to get out on the right side tomorrow. Um, as to last week, um, you know, we put ourselves in a great position uh, at 12-8. And then unfortunately, the last 20 minutes, you know, we kind of um, conspired to grab defeat from the jaws of victory and uh, made some, some poor decisions. Uh, didn't execute as well as we could have done. Uh, you know, we had a very good self-reflective meeting on Monday and we're not far off. You know, it's, um, it's been a frustrating couple of weeks because we know that the boys have got more to give. Um, I've got more to give, the team have got more to give and uh, we, we fully um, anticipate showing that tomorrow. So thanks again for your support. We'll see you tomorrow and uh, let's see this through together.